Nikki, the East 99 frontage road remains closed tonight here behind me, just south of Hammer Lane. As deputies continue to investigate here in Stockton, the San Joaquin County Sheriff's Office says it all started with that white car there beyond the crime scene tape. A Stockton family visibly shaken Thursday after finding out their loved one was shot and killed by a San Joaquin County Sheriff's deputy. Hurt. It's horrible. The Sheriff's Office says the deputy shot the man because he stabbed one of its canine deputies named Jet in the face after they sent the dog in to get him out of his car. The suspect stabbed our canine, resulting in an officer-involved shooting. San Joaquin Sheriff spokesperson Heather Brent says deputies initially deemed the man's car suspicious because it was parked on the side of the road. That's when they made contact with the man inside and found out he was wanted for a felony warrant. Brent says the man refused deputies' orders to get out of the car multiple times until he finally got out, but with a knife in his hand. Then things escalated. The deputies used non-lethal force to attempt to detain the, the driver, but unfortunately that did not work. They then deployed our canine. Brent says that's when the man stabbed canine Jet in the face three times. Then deputies shot him. The man's family now left wondering how it got to this point. He wasn't a bad man. I mean, yeah, he's had a difficult past. He's been living on this road in his car for some time now. He was parked on the side of the road. There would have been no reason for him to be disturbed. I mean, a majority of the cops, they're, they're familiar with him. And he was just here parked. That's where he sleeps. They've never had issues with him in the past. I don't understand what took place. No word yet on when the East 99 frontage road will be back open this evening. As for K-9 Jet, we do know that he was sent to a local veterinarian. He underwent some emergency surgery. He's since out of that surgery and expected to be okay. Live in Stockton, covering local news that matters, I'm Zach Boetto, Fox 40 News.